What's up, Wilton? This is Warrior Sports Week on Good Morning, Wilton. My name is Alex Kate, and we're back again this week with girls basketball and wrestling. Let's get into it. The varsity girls basketball team played the Norwalk Bears this past week, and it was scoring back and forth right from the start with a great three-point shot you saw from Maddie Deneen, but the Bears moved the ball well and answered right back against the Warriors. With many assists from both teams paid off by great shooting, it was an exciting game full of three-level scoring on both sides of the court. You see the Bears moved it well, so did the Warriors. It was a really exciting game to be at and very nice shots both ways. For the Warriors, Deneen was really a standout, making some great shots down the stretch. Really kept the Warriors in it, but it was the Norwalk Bears going on a major second half scoring run to win the game 40-22. to They got great perimeter shooting, specifically from number 15, Tiffany Martinez on their team. Uh, the Bears won this game, but the Warriors, great performance from them. Exciting to watch their games, and they really put on a show. Tough loss for the girls basketball team, but now we're going to get into our highlight of the week that's behind me, the boys wrestling team. Let's get right into this. The boys wrestling team took on the Weston Trojans this past week, and there were multiple guys who really shined on the mat. We start with Graham Kowal here with a series of takedowns. Big victory for him, earning his squad three points in the match. Great performance from Graham that night. And then we see Liam Pearsall, a senior captain of the team, earning the Warriors six points in a dominant performance here. You see he pinned his opponent to the mat here, secured the six points for the Warriors. We're going to move on to Liam Porter, who's a sophomore with a great move here, getting his opponent on his back and securing the six points for the Warriors there. And finally, we're going to move into Max Skolnick's match with an enormous takedown for him, getting a win. The Warriors had a great performance against a good Weston team, but ultimately lost by a 48-35 score. Let's hear what senior captain Steven Scavetta and Liam Pearsall had to say about the growth of Wilton wrestling over the years. I've wrestled for most of my life, and when I started, the program wasn't really big. This wasn't really big. And, you know, we've been building it up every year I've been here, and this is probably like the biggest team we've ever had. So yeah. I'm hoping we can get a good team in the future. Thank you, everybody, for watching Warrior Sports League on Good Morning Wilts in the second episode of this winter season. Thank you, everybody, for coming. Make sure to come back next week for even more sports news and updates. As always, my name is Alex Kay, signing off.